What's up everybody, the CEO, the money maker, the one and only storm taker baby and I'm back with another mother loving video and for this one guys we got the new street updates coming to Clash of Clans, well already in Clash of Clans guys and we'll be checking out, we'll be doing our reaction video of the new street um streak event guys i'll be watching judo thoughts video as you know he is the father of clash of clans guys and he's gonna let us know everything we need to know you're gonna get my full-on reaction make sure you smash that like button baby and turn on that bell notification or i'm gonna come get you in your mom's basement baby without further ado without the talking without the walking let's jump on into the video and let's have a good time baby magic edit all right so let's do this is a daily reward track that you progress through with multiplayer attacks. Okay. A completely new event. We've not had anything like it before, so let me tell you everything you need to know. As long as I love the Judas Sword song. You will find the streak event within the event tab. This first one lasts okay. for 10 days, but the time 10 days, all right. Displayed. 8 days daily multiplayer battle tasks before, before the, the task timer time runs out. out. Okay. All right, so let's see this. Complete a, a task every day within the given time limit to extend your streak. A longer streak unlocks bigger league bonuses, multipliers and other uh rewards. If you don't complete your task in time, start over, use gems to retry the task. Can't wait until the next task unlock. Speed the spend gems to unlock it. Okay. Informational screen, but I will assure to go through this. All right, let's, let's see. A task every day within the given time. Okay, I just read this. Your streak. A longer streak unlocks bigger league bonus. Okay, is it something like a daily reward? Your task in time, you start over or, use gems or is it like a streak for the amount of matches you win? And there is also a cool down period in between each task, which if you can't wait for, you can spend gems to unlock it. Okay. So it's important to keep in mind when you look at this first task that this event is aimed at get two star attack with 60% discard. Oh, okay. Or do multiple attacks every single day, you will complete this event basically by doing nothing different. Re exactly. Rewards for you. But for somebody that doesn't necessarily. Oh, we got daily rewards. What this event is aimed to help with. Get a two star attack with 60%. Finally, they're listening to the Clash of Clans community. Not one star to complete this task. There we go. Once you complete a task, you okay. get a nice little notification next to the event tab. So mm -hmm. when I open that up, you can see that I can claim. So what does that 10% trophy mean? Street oh, street However, bonus. When the first task is completed. That is when the timers start. Oh. Once this happens, you will have 24 hours to complete, complete the task. Two, get two star. So you have one task per day. If okay. You fail to do the task within that time, your streak bonus is lost and you go back to the start of the track. I am not going to let that happen though, so I will get my minimum. And since you only got a lot amount of days, guys, you got to make sure you do these tasks um each day cuz you you only have 8 days. And it's one task a day, right? Time of task three is exactly the same as when I finished task two. That is yeah. because as soon as you unlock a task, a 24-hour cool cooldown starts for the next task. Okay. Should there only be 10 hours left when you complete task number two, then task three would have a 10-hour cooldown. Okay. So you could technically complete one This is interesting. One minute remaining, and then almost instantaneously complete the next task. But essentially, you just need to log in once per day to do this, or if you're an active player, do what you normally do. I will okay. explain the yeah, I want to see some different type of tasks, though, like only you can only use these type of heroes or something else i want to see something unique i have to use um the fireball on my wizard on my grand wizard like one of those specific stuff to complete the task mm -hmm. this means if you know you're not going to be online for a 24 hour period but mm -hmm. you do not want to lose your streak bonus this is one way of protecting it the okay. other way is if you have failed to complete your task and your streak is broken you either start over from the beginning or you 160 gems Whew, and are you just day 2 you are using gems to skip the 
cooldown whenever you unlock a task. That is when the 24 hour cooldown for the next task begins. Okay. So even if you get to the stage where you have multiple days to complete a task, you're never then going to have more than 24 hours of cooldown for the next one. And okay. As task five, this is the first time you require a three star. Okay. You might have noticed as I was going through the tasks, but each one scales up in the damage percentage. That yeah, I, yeah, I've been seeing that. Day. That is because the Clash team said another goal of this event is mm -hmm. not just to encourage players to log in. We're going to do this in one day, baby. We're going to do this in one day. Attack, and some of them don't attack other than using a couple of sneaky goblins to snipe collectors. Mm -hmm. This incentivizes them via the rewards to, to get yeah, a three-star baby. Involved in the game. Yes, but sir. It's not like you're going to have to grind for this event. You will get the bonus. We're gonna beat this event in one day, baby. I promise y'all. Easy, easy work. Applied to your league loot, not the star bonus, which happens once per day by collecting five stars. This is once you are in a league. You get oh, so it's now you can have wow. So wow, the higher, up the higher the league. Star wow so they're incentivizing you to push to higher leagues now finally trophies finally get a use to do wow as mentioned earlier should you fail to complete a task they're pushing you your streak you lose your overall streak bonus they're pushing you to get more trophies guys gems to get it back task five gives you 20 percent task six gives you 30 percent bonus so you can get up to a 100 percent league loot bonus this means you will double your loot bonus Oof. every attack Oof mean you would get an extra 20,000 dark elixir and 2.7 million Oof. gold and elixir each day for your eight attacks remember that you have to get at least a 70 percent attack to gain 100 percent of your loot bonus Oof. by completing the final task on day seven which is again a three star you unlock three thousand shiny or this is helpful for any player but once you have done this and you have completed the track your streak bonus is therefore locked in you can't lose i can't lose no other tasks to complete. okay so, so the faster i complete this the more i can get loot out of it damn i got my live stream idea for today now be creative and trying to cater to as many different player types as possible. I mm -hmm. hope this video has helped you to thoroughly understand the streak mm. event. Best of luck with it and have fun. Shout, shout out to Judo, guys. Shout out to Judo. Judo is a day one supporter when it comes, well, day one when it comes on to Clash of Clans. You already know everything when Judo comes out with it, baby. He's like the Clash of Clans wiki. Uh, shout out to Judo. Guys, go check out Judo's video. You already probably checked out Judo's video already. But I did just start the video because I want to get my full reaction towards that video. Guys, it is amazing. I love this idea. This is something new. They haven't done this before. So I'm I'm grateful. I'm gonna push trophies. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do this all in one day. I know I'm gonna spend a bunch a bunch of gems on this, but I don't care, guys. I love this ability to get that extra loot that league bonus so now i'm gonna have to go to legends league baby legends league on my town all 11 guys so guys if you did enjoy the video make sure you smash it and don't dash it <laughs> you know your boys here every single day we grinding we're on timing shout out to judo for that video guys but what am i most excited for is the loot bonus and the shiny ores I am very excited for the shiny ores because I do want to level up my hero equipment. I am way back when it comes on to hero equipment. And I love that they're reaching out and understanding what the community wants. CEO out, baby.